World of Books presents Decline in Reading. Welcome to another episode of The World of Books. Here we are at the lovely home of the Johnson family. There's Dad going off to work. And here is Mom taking out a fresh sheet of cookies out of the oven. But I wonder where Jimmy is. Ah, there he is. Hey, Jimmy, what you doing there? Oh, nothing. Just watching television. Wouldn't you rather be reading a fun and exciting adventure book? No, reading's for losers! As scary as this sounds, many Americans like Jimmy here are losing interest in reading. In 1982, a survey was done by the National Endowment of the Arts showing that only 56.7% of American adults were reading. The survey was conducted again in 2002 to show that it had dropped to 46.7%. That's almost 20 million potential readers lost. It has only gotten worse since then. So what's causing this? Well, many say it has to do with the different forms of media, such as television, movies, and video games. Over 35 movies made in the year 2007 were based off books. Many people go to the movie as an excuse not to read the book. Hey, Jimmy, have you ever heard of a series of books called The Lord of the Rings? You mean the movies? See what I mean? A recent Scholastic report shows that 44% of children of the age of 5 through 8 are frequent readers, but that drops drastically to 16% at the age of 15 through 17. The report says the cause of this may be from the influence of parents, revealing that only 21% of all parents frequently read. So why should we worry about this? Well, without exercising your brain daily, your brain will start to deteriorate as early as the age of 18. It is known that reading is the best way to exercise one's brain. So the only way to solve this large decline is to read, and read daily. So let's see if we can get Jimmy to do just that. Hey Jimmy, did you know that books not only can be fun, but also exercise your brain at the same time? No, I didn't know. Well, here, try this book on for size. Wow, Jimmy is in the earth. Thank you, mister. Now you see, America, try to put down the television remote or video game controller and pick up a book every once in a while. And remember, reading not only stops communism, but is a part of the American way.